right, come on there, missus. Yeah. Get brushing, brushing, brushing. Right, looking pretty. There you go. Yeah, looking very pretty. There, I think we're all done. Yeah, we're all done? Okay, good. Next. Right. Here we go. You got a lot of hair, mister. I'm a little bit jealous. That's a lot of hair. There. Lovely. There you go. I think we're pretty much done. Right, next. There. Right, just get you organised. Yep, there we go. Got to make some money, haven't we? Hey? Got to pay the bills to live in this, live in this lovely house. Yeah. Fix your eye. You ain't got that much hair, to be honest, mate. Alright. There we go. Next. Come on, then. Are you sure they're going to believe this one's real? Are you sure? Firstly, it's kind of... It's a lion. And it's quite small for a lion. It's a cat. Okay. Oh, come on, cat. Come on, Timmy the cat. There we go. Meow, meow. There we go. Come on, really. Greetings and salutations my friends, welcome to episode 6 of The Journeyman. As you can see, we picked up a little bit of a part-time job doing some dog grooming. So that's not too bad, pick up a few quid here and there. The last one was definitely real, it was definitely real, don't go back and look, it was real, okay? Right, let's get you updated with what's been going on. And, um, what's the best way to explain it? Well, the best way to explain this is we haven't won a single game. But we've also only lost one. Ah... Here is the, yeah, we're the Draw Masters. We've turned into the Draw Masters. So after the real game, we've played Newton, Newtown and uh, drew one all with them. Early goal for Harry Owen and Chris Lindsay own goal in the 15 minutes. Total fuck up, one all. Uh, pretty even game, actually. With them, Connors Key, we lost 2-0 to them. Deserved two late goals, but but they were just waiting to score. I think they could have scored three or four. We then had a really good draw against Airbus, 0-0. Um, Loki, shut up. I'm trying to record. That's very rude. So we drew against Airbus. Very, very happy with that. Then we bang a city. We got a one-all draw. Gwen Howell with his first goal of the season. Really happy with that. Um, late equaliser after a Nod Nodiello goal. And then uh, Kevin Druids. one all. So the last couple of games, we've actually changed formation. I'll take you through it. Harry Owen got our only goal. Hang on one second. We're going to murder a dog. There you go. It was the postman. He likes to bark at the postman, as do a lot of dogs. Yeah, stop barking, please. Right. We, we've been doing all right. We've gone with a new tactic. Somebody pointed out in the um, comments that they're not learning any tactic. They're not getting familiar with any sort of process. It's like none of them have ever played football before and none of them are ever willing to learn or have the ability to learn how to play football. It's like an alien concept. No matter how we've been training these three tactics the entire season, this is what they look like. Obviously, amateur team, that's the problem. So I thought, my initial thought was go 4-4-2. Everybody knows how to play that. Even that was quite a tricky situation for them and they, and they were still struggling. So... And we weren't getting better at it. So I thought, why not use the tactic that's probably been most successful for me so far in um, FM17, which is my Liverpool tactic. Uh, it's a little bit complex. We've made some tweaks to it just to simplify it a little bit for the team. Like, trying to show Lemon what a complete wingback was just blew his mind. So we're not going to bother with... We're just going for standard wingbacks. It's a little bit simpler. Um, it actually suits his stats pretty well because he's decent at going forward and defensive-ishness. 
um, as good as they can be. Don't really have one for the right hand side, but I'll, uh, right back is going to play the wing back option. Uh, three centre backs with Bell as the uh, main centre back, the legend, the captain that is. He keeps getting, I keep getting news articles saying, whoa, are you disappointed that Bell hasn't scored for six games? I'm like, he's a fucking centre back, you Bell end. I'm playing him as a centre back. <sighs> So apart from that, it's been going well. We've made some slight tactics. My normal Liverpool one, we have a player here. But I decided I wanted to pack out the midfield a little bit more, try and win that midfield battle with numbers. And we've took off a couple of the options that um, like run at defence and stuff like that, which I just... It's just not going to happen. And uh, so we've played it for a couple of games, and we've got two draws. Um, a really good draw against Bangor City. Kevin Drew, who are struggling. Draw at home wasn't great, but we probably deserve to win that game. So let us get into this game then, shall we? Shall we? Um, let's have a finance check. Oh, we've got back down to 16 grand. We were up to seven, heady heights of 17 at one stage. The league table's looking like this. Um, Balor are top by three points over TNS. And uh, it's pretty close. It's pretty close in the mid-table. We've, we're eight, uh, six points clear of relegation. So that's really, really good. So I'm really happy with that. We're playing Balor in the JD Welsh Cup. Didn't even know it was a thing. But apparently it is a thing. So I'm hoping there's money to be made here. Although they are top of the league. So this um, could get ugly. But apart from that, you know, we should be fine. And then our next game is against Aberdeen Swith. Right. Let's do this. I don't know why I came back a day early. But we'll get straight into it. Yeah, so they need to stop telling Bell that he's not scoring goals. Because he's playing as a centre-back. I wish the game could see that and understand that. Will Fuller is injured out with a lower back. Sorry, Will Fuller, you're, you're injured. Three months. You're not. I'm giving some game time to Chris Willis anyway for a few games, so it's not an issue. So we've got three goalkeepers, luckily, because two of them are injured. So I don't normally have three goalkeepers, but maybe it was a sign. Here we go. This is going to be a tricky one, I think. Top of the league. We got destroyed by second in the league, so top of the league is, is just going to be worse, isn't it? By my maths. Right. I think I'm going to give another start to Gwayne Howell because he did alright, scored his first goal. We'll give him another goal. The reason why TJ Nagy just gone off the ball, look at that. 6.32 average, which is pretty damn horrific. That's hard to be that bad at football, uh, but he's managing it, so fair play to him. Um, we do need some, if we're going to continue with this formation, we do need some extra central midfielders. We have got two coming in. Um, we've got Jake Cook coming in. Uh, as an advanced playmaker, which we don't really have in the squad at the moment. So hopefully, 23 years old, English player. Uh, pretty versatile, actually. Not too bad. Decent amount of pace and technique. I quite like him. And then we've got Tom Dodd, um, who is more of a defensive midfielder. So we've got a bit more variety as our team. 18 determination, liking it. 23-year-old Welshman, previously played for massive teams like Buckley, Airbus and Penny Kai. Penny K. Pe Penny. Right. Let's get into it. Let's see if this formation is going to hold up at all um, against the better teams. I fully expect Bala to record easy win. Let's have a look at their star man as opposed to our star man. So our star man is our third choice goalkeeper, Chris Willis. <laughs> Amazing. Their star man is Chris Venables. Oh, look. Oh, look at those. Those mentals. I'm not jealous. Right. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Let's go. Nobody fancies us to win. Let's maybe not start with a negative. Let's give the fans a good... Yeah, I think that's fine. Good performance. Just do what you can. We need a bit of green. Everything, every little helps. Right, let's get into it. This could this could be ugly. I've, I've only tried this tactic for two games and two one all draws, but against okay opposition, not, not good teams. We, a cup win... They've got, there's got to be some sort of prize money in the Welsh Cup, surely. A couple of grand. It's all I need. You know, if we can win that, you know, that'll help us. That'll set us up for the rest of the season. Right, Farah. Lovely ball out. I'm commentating the highlights, uh, the kickoff, so which is never a good idea. Because things like that happen. Okay. So my question of the day to you guys, this is really going to help me out. I might actually make it a poll, a straw poll in the comments or the description. So please do vote on it. Um, but how did you find this channel? Well, did, was it like uh, you did a YouTube search for like maybe you joined me on the Liverpool save or the Bolton save or whatever it was? No, no, no. 
near post. My star man, oh, Chris Venables, just beat my star man in goal. Brilliant, brilliant. Okay, three minutes gone, one nil down. Good. How, how are you not even saving that? That's a sim simple save. You just literally stand next to your post and you save that. I'm not going to get angry about goalkeepers. But how did you find this channel? Did you find it through a YouTube search? Was it a recommended video? Did you hear about it on Twitter or Reddit or Facebook? Or it would really help me to sort of discover where you guys are coming from. And if you can remember what your first the video was, the first one that you watched, that would be incredibly helpful to me. Just to work out where where the traffic's coming from, where you guys are are coming from. That would be brilliant. That's offside, surely? Yes, Willis. What a, he's the star man, as you can see with a crack and save low down to his right. You've got to try and pick it up. Okay, but we're, they're getting chances, but we're creating a couple as well, so it's not horrifically bad. It's, it's quite bad. I'm trying to help us a little bit here. Oh, look, we've just left that player there. Look, near post. Yeah. Oh, Willis. I'm not sure how much he knew about it, but he saved it, kind of-ish. The thing I've noticed with this formation is that it, it will, regardless of who we're playing, we will create chances. It's just we'll probably concede a few chances as well I'm doing that sort of remember that episode of Big Bang Theory where Raj had that medication so he could talk to women and he just had a weird tics that's what sorry that's what it just looked like if you don't watch Big Bang Theory that's going to make no sense whatsoever we've not been good enough so make sure the team understand our disappointment Grr, team that's it they should understand that okay Oh shit, it's only five subs, isn't it? My two strikers aren't even on the bench. I was going to bring on another striker. Mm, professional. Right, they're only 1 0 up. This is still doable. I'm still not quite sure what. If we should go standard, control, counter. Probably counter is the best idea, I imagine, but. This isn't really a counter attacking more tactic, to be honest. I suppose we could make a couple of adjustments and make it into a counter attacking. All right, Lemon. To goal, just a hopeful ball in that doesn't. Oh, look at what! What is that? What? Why are three of you standing there? I got no words to say about that goal. That was the most ridiculous free kick routine in the world. So the three players that were supposed to be defending in case of a counter attack were all standing right next to each other for the free kick. Amazing. I told you, it's like they don't, they've never seen football before. It's like getting a bunch of Americans. Soccer. Sorry, Mac, I know I've got some MLS fans, so sorry about Americans. But you know what I'm like, like you know what I'm talking about. It's, it's like they've never played football before. Uh, Ridian can come on for Gaul. They're all having a shit game. There's no changes to be made that make any sense. Okay, we're going for a more attacking fullback option. I don't think it really matters. But we've, we've created some chances. Go on. Go on, Bell. Go on. Farah. Yes! Come on! First goal of the season for Ibrahim Farah. One of our best, sort of most solid players, I'd say, without being spectacular. He's done well for us this season. Bell with the assist. Just side foots it in. Side foots it in. We've got 15 minutes. We've got a chance. I said it creates it creates chances. Obviously, we've conceded a bunch as well. But we've created eight chances against top of the league. I'll take it. Come on. Team talk. Oh, no. They will score now, guaranteed, because I'm doing this. This always happens. Push forward. Oh, Willis has scored. Saved. He, he didn't score. He saved. Not bad, boy. Well, not bad. Okay, last ten minutes. Can we create one more chance? Just give us one more chance. Oh. Oh, if we can nick it. Oh, yes. Yes. Owen, please. Yes! Come on! Get in there. Harry Owen with the late... So, lost for words because it's so excited. Eighth of the season, Harry Owen. Lovely ball inside from Davies. Honours a sub. Harry Owen, kind of a bit lucky. The defender got a deflection on it trying to slide in. Um, is it extra time? No idea. Okay, oh, extra time for an amateur team. We are going to be dead after this. We've got no strikers on the bench, so we might as well uh, use our final sub. Um, oh, let's not go attacking. Let's, let's go standard. 
Um, centre back. Bell's looking very knackered. He's an old man, to be fair. He's playing well, though. 6.8. You know, he's staying on. Gareth Edwards, he's another old man. We'll get rid of him. Come on, boys. Come on. We've come back into this game. Go on, Lemon. Commentating the kickoff. It's like amateur hour. Oh, he, tried, he beat one. That was it. Okay, Bell's just fouled somebody. That's fine. See, we're giving them a game. That's the difference. With this formation, we, a couple of the other losses we had, it was like we hung on and then conceded. And it was just like, oh, we, it's like we were hanging on for a nil-nil draw every time. At least with this formation. Oh, my God, that's a mistake. And Hal's going to pounce. Go on, Hal. Go on, Hal. Get your second. Get your second. Oh. oh that was it. If it was Harry Owen, obviously, we know he would have scored. Oh, but that was such a good chance. But at least this formation, we're just we're going down punching, basically. We're going down swinging if we do lose. Owen, Davies, find a pass. That's it. Keep the ball, keep the ball. Lovely. Duffy. Nice. Better. Pierce. Into Owen. We need you in the box, Owen. Davies. Davies. Oh, it's blocked. Owen's got it again, though. Floats onto the back post. Nobody there. Duffy on the volley. Duffy! Duffy's fucking scored. Duffy Duck is scored. First goal of the season for Daffy. Jesus Christ. We've 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 done magic here, people. Now what the fuck do we do? Look at Daffy. Oh, it's beautiful. Goalkeeper's an absolute joke. But apart from that <laughs> Like, wait. Pause. Pause. Okay. Davies has actually done well since he's come on. What do we do? First thing we do, what we got left? Still quite okay. We're not going to go too crazy. We're going to go counter attacking. Um, do I drop these back into a solid five? I think we do. I think we do. Not too, not too like crazy defensive flat back five, but we'll keep them on full back support. Sorry, Pierce, you're just gonna have to do a job there, mate. Um, and then. Daffy, central midfielder, defend. We'll drop you to support. We still need an outlet attacking-wise. Right, which one of you wants to play somewhere other than striker? I'm going to say Gwen Howell because you're the like not as good as Owen. So that's basically why you've been chosen there. Um, we could have. Oh, I don't even know what to play here. Um, advanced playmaker supports probably that. Okay. Instructions. Clear the ball. Um, probably want to... If we're going to counter, we probably going to go more direct, pass into space. Just basically hoof it. That's what I'm trying to say to you now, right? Stop being more expressive. Can we go get stuck in? Get stuck in. I feel like we're going to concede. I feel like we're going to concede... And if we do concede, then I have to go back and change everything I've just done, which is really annoying. Come on. Chris Venables, their star man, has just been injured. And I don't think they've got a sub. Ooh, that could be quite cheeky. Come on, it's written in the stars. Written in the stars, million miles away. I'm a miles away. You can tell I'm nervous. I'm a, I'm a nervous singer. Ten minutes. Eight minutes. Six minutes. I can do numbers. Two minutes. One minute. It's the last chance saloon. Surely that's it. Surely that's it, ref. Come on, you beauty. What a result that is against top of the league. Knocked him out of the cup. Fantastic comeback indeed, Mr. Assistant Manager. That's what we needed to get this season really kicked on. Shh. Oh, you bloody Bala fans. All seven of you. Shh. Yeah. Come on, prize money. I want, I want cash monies for that. No. Is there any money at all? So, nothing for winning it, but loser prize money is one and a half thousand. Okay. <laughs> that doesn't seem right, but okay. Fine. Right. 
My word, that was a game and a half, my friends. Hope you enjoyed that bad boy. Right, on to the next game. Aberystwyth, bring it on, motherfucker. Right, as we come up to the Aberystwyth game, I've got to tell you a funny story, and that was on Twitter. So, as you probably know, I've been in contact with Cardiff Met Uni. We follow each other on Twitter, because, you know, we're bestest buds now. Um, and a couple of the players, and we've had a bit of banter back and forth. One of my subscribers, I totally forgot your name, so I apologise, um, tweeted me, because he's also taken up the same challenge. So he's doing Cardiff Met Uni. And he showed a screenshot of his first season, and he amazingly finished fifth. Did really, Somebody else actually won the league, which is incredible. Uh, but he finished fifth in the season. Um, and then TNS, who are like the top team in Wales, um, offered him the job and he took the TNS job, which is quite an upgrade. It's a part time job, you know, popular team in the division. Really good. But he tweeted that to Cardiff Met Uni and me and TNS. And then TNS tweeted, the team, TNS, tweeted, Sorry, Cardiff Met Uni, you'll have to go looking for another manager. I was like, Oh my god, this is weird, real life spilling into game. It's bizarre. So yeah, I just thought that was quite funny when I was like, oh my god, they're getting the Welsh Premier League teams are going in for some banter. It's amazing. That's why small football teams are better than big clubs. And I say that as a Liverpool fan. Because you don't get, obviously, you don't get shit like that with big clubs, you know. They don't, they can't interact with all the fans because there's so many millions of them. But when you've got a small, close-knit fan base, you can have so much more fun with it. Right. Okay. Aber can we... Use this win to smash Aberystwyth. That's what I'm hoping. I don't, uh, forget smash. S win against Aberystwyth. I'm going to go Atif Bashir, the international. It's coming on with Harry Owen. Work some magic. Um, Ridian, I need you training advanced playmaker middle, please. This seems almost pointless. I've got to say doing this because they don't do any training. So asking somebody to learn a new position is, is yeah, doesn't really work too much. Um, we just got to hobble along pretty much until we get into the uh, January transfer window. Get the two new central midfielders in. Maybe look to strengthen with a couple more. We're not paying them any money, so we might as well just sign a bunch of players and hope for the best, really. So that's that's going to be the plan in January. So I've got the scouts. My scouts have um, scouting ability and potential uh, of four or five. So it's like sending a blind man to go and watch a player at the end of the day. Nobody fancies us. No, let's stop saying that, Mr. Assistant, okay? Yeah, let's go for it. I fully expect you to... End. Okay, not poor form. Um, come on, lads. There you go. Nice positive. Let's not give him a shit sandwich. Let's give him just positive work. There's a lot more to come from you, okay? Same as you lot. Same as you lot. There we go, some green. Let's not start with going, I know you're shit at football, but let's try and win a game. No, that's not how you do it. That's not good motivational technique. <laughs> Right, it's away from home. We've struggled away from home. To be fair, we've struggled at home as well, but even more so. Can we come back and work our magic again? We need. It'd be really annoying if we get beat. Fair enough, but if we lose like three or four nil after that last result, that's going to be really annoying. Okay, it's one minute thirty, and I'm not liking the because that that just smells like goal. And yeah, if it smells like goal, it looks like goal. It's probably a goal. Bellone goal. Well, he's scored now, so they'll stop going on about him in the, on the papers. There's a lot of own goals in this division. Ball in. Edwards clears it onto the back of Bell's back of his legs, and it goes in. Okay, good. No shots. 1-0. That's what I like to see. Let's just hope that was a freakish incident. Here we go. Is this our ball? Could be. Hiller floats onto the back post. Linsky's there. It's going to come back out to Farah. Dinks it in. Edwards floats the ball in. It's hit the post. It's Oh, my God. It's cleared off the line. Oh, man. I thought that was going to be another stupid own goal. I would have taken a stupid own goal at this point. Okay, Willis. Let's see some magic. Oh, that's a beautiful... That's a... Play... Oh, man. There you go. If you could encapsulate non-league football in five seconds, that was it. Go and watch that five seconds again. Ridiculous rollout. Player mishandles it. Horrific back pass. Striker pounces and then just smacks it miles wide. Welcome to non-league, everyone. 
Oh, Duffy. Oh, there's space on that left-hand side. He's found him this time. Go on, Lemon. Lovely volleyed cross. Oh, my God. Keeper's tipped onto his own post. Owen's there. We need you in the middle more, Owen. Okay. Is this... Is that the end of the highlight? Oh, go on, Daffy. Don't mess it up. Nice ball inside. Owen. What's he going to do? That. Apparently, he's going to do that. See, we're, we're doing fine. That freakish goal at the beginning. <clears throat> um, I'm not going to be harsh on him. There you go. Boom. Sea of green, motherfuckers. We're going to attack him. We're coming out all guns blazing in the second half. No messing about. We're playing the better team here. Oh, we are the better team. Not we're playing against the better team. You know, you know what I meant. Right. Highlights. Okay, TJ Nagy, can you... Stop the run of horrific form that you have. Um, I'm going to put advance forward and poacher. Because, you know, let's get two up top. Running the line. Yeah, he's in their pace. Come on, Nagy. And not had a single shot on target. <laughs> Come on. Um, push forward. That's what we're going to go with. 15 minutes left. Nothing's happening, is it? It's a highlight. It looks like it might be theirs unless we can nick it. Oh, oh, go on, Lemon. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Do something with it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Go on, Owen. Find Nagy. Go on, Nagy. Please, Nagy. Please, Nagy. Please, Nagy. Oh! That was it. I think that was it. That was the golden chance. Uh, we played really well this this game. That's poor. Oh, we've played well. Oh, is the highlight still going? Is the highlight still going? Don't fuck it up, Willis. Please don't fuck it up. Please don't fuck it up. Just hoof it. That's fine. No. No. He's jumped the tackle. No. No. God damn it. Undeserved. That's their first fucking shot on target. No, I don't want to fuck off with your replay bullshit. I don't want to see your replay bollocks. I oh, don't go and score a third. That is just rude. You don't deserve three. Well done, Bell. That's it. Not in one. And then just give it straight back. That's the spirit. Yeah, give it straight back again. Keep keep giving them chances. Three. Apparently that was a shot. Apparently that was a highlight. Ah, oh, man. Undeserved this one, I feel. It's a decent away from home performance. I'm going to take, take the positives from this game. Go on. Go on, Owen. Find Nagy. Nagy needs a goal. Oh. Yes. No. Okay. Good. Game over. 2-0 loss. It feels so much worse after our heroic game. <laughs> the last game was so heroic. What is going on here? Look. This one from the training ground. Ho-hum. We opened ourselves up a little bit going to attack him. But before then, we were the better team. Hmm. That's disappointing, boys. Uh, who's stressed? Bashir's stressed. Oh, we dropped into 10th. It's okay. Six points clear. That's still quite a nice, healthy margin. But we wanted to get top six before the break. Um, oh, my God. Neil Prestatin boss, Neil Gibson, is scouting. 
Harry Owen. Please don't take Harry Owen. They're the division below me. This is how bad we are. They're semi-professional in the division below. How is that fair? What's our next game? Right, so we're going to come back, I think. We're going to play a bunch of games. Oh, my God, we've got the Balor double header. Should we just come back for that? Glutton for punishment. I think we should come back for the Balor double header. That's evil. Oh, God. There you go, guys. Hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, please do hit that like button. It helps, um, you know, it helps know the uh, words. It helps me know that you enjoyed it obviously but it also helps you know the video get ranked and the video get found on youtube so any help you can give me like with tweets and likes is always much appreciated uh, and like i said before let me know how you found the channel i'd be really interested to know how you found me as a person as a youtube channel thank you very much guys love you all see you in the next episode bye bye we're gonna win a game i promise some stage in, in the league we're gonna win a game all right <sighs>